It's beautiful, sunny, and warm outside, and the last thing you want to do is spend time inside working out at the gym. Well, you don't have to. Instead, you can take advantage of the city's QR fitness trails. Our QR trails feature a sign throughout seven different stations. So we have an introduction sign, we have a warm-up station, and then you can continue on doing the exercises. The exercises can be done at a beginner, intermediate, or advanced level. And if you don't have your smartphone with you, you can definitely just look at the uh, sign. It has the instructions on how to do the routine. Due to increased popularity, five new QR fitness trails have been added since last summer. We have 10 QR fitness trails in total throughout the city of Hamilton. If you start out in Winona, we have a new park called Lake Point and it has the signs posted there. And then if you move up the mountain, we have TB McQuesten and Newlands Park. If you move out to Mount Hope, we have Southampton Park. And if you move all the way out to Flamborough, we also have Strabane Park that has a QR fitness trail. Whether you're looking to challenge your metabolic threshold or you just want to wait in incorporate the outdoors into your workout routine, the QR fitness trails address all physical activity levels. We're going to be at one of the QR fitness trail beginning stations, station one, and we'll be doing some warm up activities at a beginner level, an intermediate level, and then I'm going to show you also some advanced moves. These are available through your app on your phone, or you can just look at the static images on the signs. Uh, the warm-up consists of pretty much anything that will help to get your heart rate up and also to get that blood flowing and your muscles warm and ready to move. And we're going to do first a light jog. So just bringing your knees up, not too high. This is really and truly just getting things warmed up, just getting uh, your body ready to do more vigorous movement along the trail. The second warm-up activity is skipping, not with a real skipping rope, but that same skipping action that you would have if you were if you were jumping over a rope. Again, your feet don't have to leave the ground. This is just getting your body moving, getting it ready to do more work along the, red, the rest of the QR trail. And finally, if you want to do a little bit more vigorous or advanced of a warm up, you can bring those knees up high and get them closer to your heart uh, so that you're getting that blood moving uh, even more vigorously. To find the nearest QR Fitness Trail, you can visit hamilton.ca slash QR Fitness Trail, or you can visit one of the city's recreation centers and pick up a QR Fitness Trail poster. For Inside City of Hamilton, I'm Kinga Moshinsky.